welcome back. You know what time it is. Mm -hmm. Ian, it is Monday. It is time for our Que Pasa segment where we help you plan your week here in the Borderlands. Well, as always, we speak with Lauren Falco from Destination El Paso who tells us all of the week's upcoming events. Take a look. back to another episode of Cape Pasa. I'm joined here with Lauren Falco from Destination El Paso. As always, we'll tell you all about the fun events you can expect here in the borderland. But first, we are at Madre Rosa. It is a new place in West El Paso. Lauren, tell us more about this place. So this space is really cool. It's actually right next to the outlet, so you can go eat, you can come for dinner, for lunch, it's awesome. Um, and they are, I mean, it's an incredible space. We're in here right now and I was like blown away by the design and they have a ton of specials. They have some really great specials throughout the week. They do happy hour almost every single day. Um, they have $3 uh, margarita. I mean, it's just amazing the, the stuff Everything that they do. Um, they do margarita Mondays that are a dollar. They have a dollar margaritas on Mondays. Like, One dollar margaritas, dollar tacos Dollar on tacos Tuesdays. on Tuesdays. Uh, they have birria for a dollar fifty, I believe. It's a pretty incredible space. Um, they also host live music. Um, each week and so banda on the stage you can have it during dinner there's just a lot of really cool aspects about this new location all right lauren time for us to get to business uh, we have a fun art show happening this week yes yeah, so starting now until march 31st in uh, san elizario out by the mission trail so the mission trail is a historic trail in el paso it's i believe nine miles it's pretty crazy it's a beautiful place for artists. Um, we actually have an art show that's called uh, Faces, Feeling, and Moments, um, and they are debuting it right now at the Mission Trail Association Visitor Center, so you can go see that now until March 31st. We also have a fun family event happening hosted by PBS. It's a classic. Um, if you liked Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood, this is essentially like his his show, his offshoot show. Uh, it's called Daniel Tiger's Neighborhood, and they host Be My Neighbor Day. This one's actually at the Region 19 Head Start uh, headquarters. And again, it's a free event. They'll have music vendors. They'll have uh, educational series, some really cool stuff. And it, it all benefits uh, the community, which is really cool. Something happening on the same day, March 23rd, for paranormal lovers. Yes, uh, if you are a ghost uh, believer or want to maybe believe in, in, in ghosts, uh, this is a perfect opportunity to try it out. Um, they're gonna have a ghost walk in Sunset Heights, which is one of the most historic neighborhoods in El Paso. Um, and it's it's gonna be kind of cool. I actually used to live in Sunset Heights and like oh, that's awesome. the vibes are spooky. So I, I feel like you could see some really cool stuff out It'll there. It'll be active. Yes, and they're meeting at Mundy Park again on March 23rd. Then March 24th, we have a market that's been happening for the past four years. Yes, uh, Miha Market, which is, it's a really cool event. So Chuko Relic puts it on um, and they have a lot of partners in the community. Uh, this one specifically benefits the Miha Scholarship Fund um, as well as a pets fund. So there is um, even a really cool, if you bring like pet donations, they'll give you a free slice of cake and a cookie. Nice. So that's pretty cool. Um, but it's happening at Chuco Relic off the gateway, kind of close to Central. Um, and again, March 24th, there's gonna be some really cool vendors out there. Go check it out, there's music. Also on the 24th, if you like a little bit of excitement yes. in your life, uh, roller it's a little different. derby. A little different. A little different. If you haven't ever heard, El Paso has a really great roller derby scene. And if you've never seen roller derby, it's incredible. These women, powerhouses, they're insane. And it's the, what was it? Easter Bunny, Easter baddies, Bunny baddies versus St. Patrick, no, St. Patty's, Patty's baddies. Braddies. Braddies. <laughs> We no, did it! We tried, <laughs> um, but it's really cool. It's uh, at the County Coliseum on March 24th, and it's just gonna be a really cool event. Perfect timing. This is, we just got our food. We can wrap things up. I'm so excited to eat this. Shrimp cocktail, what is this, chicharrones? A little queso. bit of queso. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. Okay, on. perfect breakfast for us here. All right, Lauren, thank you for joining us once again. If you missed any of the dates, the times, or any other information about the events, go to visitelpaso.com for more information. And join us again for another episode of Que Pasa next week.